goed tweede bedrijf um, is uh, act en ik heb veel al gezien dat na een act of een bedrijf dan worden die gordijnen toegemaakt en dan is dat gewoonlijk een groot verandering op die verhoog. big change in terms of props on the stage, a new setting, etc. And when it comes to a toneel, um, in Villa second, the scene changes are indicated by either music or lighting. So here, this is where we are now. Magistrate kantoor, Katheder, that's that wooden structure. For Magistrat, Benjamin is achter. So Benjamin is at the back. He's standing at the back because he's scared. So here he is thinking, I dunk, 2 mal 9 is 18. 3 mal 9 is, I tell op sy vingers, 7 20. 4 mal 9 is 36. So he's reciting the nine times table here. Vijf maal negen. And then he thinks. As hulle van my vergeet het en die deur is sluit, sal ek deur die venster klim. So the reason why he's reciting the nine times table here is because Phila uh, told him to show these people at the court that he is educated even though he didn't go to school. Obviously, he didn't go to school because Phila didn't want people to, to see or realize that she's got a white child. So, he's saying this, and she also told him how to address the, the magistrate and that he mustn't call him boss, a boss, um, and he, she gave him money to show them that they not poor, etc. So he's thinking, as hulle van my vergeet het, as hulle van my vergeet het, en die deur is sluit, sal ek dier die venster klim. So when they forget about me and they lock the doors, I will climb through the window. Die moeilijkheid is my trommel. Nou, a trommel, is a trank. Reg. Ek kan nie sonder die trommel terug gaan nie, want David se baiekie en Anna Goed is daarin. Gelukkig is die vijf shillings in my sak. Nou, shillings is the money they used in that time. Shillings. So, he, he realizes that he can get through the window, but he wouldn't be able to take his trunk with him and he has to because David, his brother, uh, his coat is in the trunk and other things and the five shillings is at least in his pocket. Mense begin skielik achter praat, dere gaan oop en toe, die magistraat. So this is now the court, uh, there are people who attended this hearing probably curious the doors open and the magistrate enters magistrate come up comes on comes on stage waarom so achter teen die muur seen kom hier why are you standing at the back against the wall son kom hier kom voor en toe step closer kom sê vir my wat jou naam is kom tell me what your name is Benjamin, kom evans nader, he comes a little closer. Benjamin, kom moet hy, magistrat, kom nader, ek kan nie hoor nie, I can't hear you. Benjamin, hoes, kofs, en kom voor en toe. Benjamin, kom moet hy, die constable, constable, comes on stage, kom binnen, kry jy koud, Benjamin, nie, so he's probably shaking, um, not because he's cold, but because he's scared. Okay. Ooh. Sure, now this thing freezes. Okay. Now, good Benjamin, I'm going to ask you a few questions. 
wat ek wil hee, jy moet baie mooi vir my beantwoord. So the ma magistrate tells Benjamin that he's going to ask him a few easy questions, which he wants him to answer as best as he can. Is jy seker jy kry nie koud nie? Are you sure you're not cold? Dis niks, wel edele heer, and I've told you wel edele heer means your honor. Die magistraat syg sy wange aan die kante in en laat het weer uitbult voor hy praat. So he's got this habit of sucking in his cheeks and then sort of letting it go and then it bulges on the sides. So people normally do that when they are thinking or they have a difficult task to complete. Kan jy onthou of jy, toe jy baie klein was, eers een ander naam gehad het. Now, this is completely a ridiculous question. How can he remember things from when he was two years old? I don't think that's really possible. Can you remember when you were very little uh, if you had a different name? So Benjamin answers, my name was my altijd Benjamin Kamuti. Magistrat, goed. Kan jy enig iets onthou voordat jy by die mense, that's now of course the kamooties, in die lange kloof beland het before you ended up there? Enige iets, anything. Nee, wel edele heer, answers Benjamin. Magistrat, ek wil hee, jy moet nou vir my so ver as moendlik terugdink. En dan moet jy vir my alles sê wat jy dink. So, this magistrate obviously didn't know much about children. He says, I want you to think as far back as possible and then tell me everything that you can remember that you are thinking of. Ek kan nie so lekker dink as ek bang is nie baas. So he says, I can't think clearly when I'm scared. Uh, boss. Now here, he makes this mistake of calling the magistrate boss. And that is a way that non-whites called blacks. Um, called, ooh, I wrote blacks here instead of whites. So, they would have called him that to show respect because they were, blacks were regarded as inferior. <coughs> Sorry. So, whites were seen as the bosses. Magistrat, se wange, cheeks in and out again, like a bubble fish. Jy hoef vir niks bang te wees nie, sê, en you don't have to be scared of anything. Ek wou maar net seker maak of jy enig iets kan onthou. I just wanted to make sure if there was something that you could remember. Dit maak jy saak as jy niks onthou nie. Doesn't matter if you can't remember anything. Omstaan nou vir my nog a klein enkie voor en toe. Ehm, um, Please step forward a, a little bit more. En dan bly staan jy net so doodstil, and then you stand there, dead still. 